There we go. Mikey Stadium built in 1924 and located okay, in Fort Putnam in West Point, New York. Let's head down to the coin toss now. It is brought to you by Coke Zero. Real Coca-Cola taste and zero calories. Enjoy everything. Uh, number eight, FA News FA Army. Beard as a <laughs> <laughs> Is he in here? Yeah, they finished stream the load on. Big pass and a big catch by Rojo, 22-yard reception. They might look at that, though. I guess, no, they're not going to look at it. Yeah, it's going to be first down and 10 for FAU. He's going to hand it off. Thrash Panda's going to get a gain of seven yards, and it'll be second and three. Yeah, the offensive line blocked really good on that play, and he got seven yards. So that was a great run, first down run by Panda. Yeah, as it's going to be second down and three. They're going to line up with two backs in the backfield. Thrash Panda is going to get the first down, four-yard gain. As it's going to be first and ten. They're going to line up in trips. Dexter's going to drop back to pass. And no, he's going to scramble. He's going to break a tackle, and then he's going to get laid out by, I believe, Chris Gentry. As it's going to be second down and six. That was a good run by Dexter. Get four yards. Yeah. Pretty good run as a second down and six as Dexter is going to scramble again. He's going to break a tackle, and there was just nowhere to go after that. I believe that was Bo Cannon with a tackle. As it's going to be third down and five. Gonna line up in the shotgun. 
Dexter's going to throw. He's going to throw. He's got a man. It's Kellen Noble, and he's going to be short of the first down. As they will be attempting the field goal. That kick is up, and it's good. FAU now up three to nothing on Army. Yeah, that was a big defensive stop over the uh, for the Army though. Um, so now let's see if their offense could come out and get a drive together. He's going to return it to the 10, the 20. There he goes to the 30, the 31 yard line. Trevion Carter with a 30 yard return. As it's going to be first and ten for Army. King's gonna hand it off. Rivers is gonna get four yards, and it will be second down and six. A good first run by Rivers up the middle for a gain of four. Yeah, as second and six. He's going to hand it off to Rivers as he breaks a couple tackles, but he's not going to get much after that as it's going to be third down and five. My screen is lagging really bad. Lizzie Wynn's going to get a 11-yard return based off of what I see. This is going to be first and 10. Dexter looking, and he's going to get hit. Ooh. That was a big hit. Yeah, he's going to feel that one. As it's going to be second down and eight from around the 43 yard line. Dexter's looking to throw. He's going to scramble and he's going to get the first down. Nine yard rush. As they are now in Army territory. They're going to line up and empty. Man in motion. Dexter's going to fake it. Looks like he was about to scramble, but he's going to throw it to Ronnie Shanahan Jr. for a two-yard gain. As it will be second down and eight. Dexter's going to hand it off to Thrash Panda, and he's going to run straight up the middle and get a gain of 14 yards and the first down. Great second down run by Panda to get 14 yards. That, that looked like a counterplay, too. As Dexter's going to break free, he's going to break a tackle, and he will score. A.J. Dexter gets a 33-yard touchdown run. Great read option by Dexter and way to pull it and keep it. And he gets downfield and he breaks the tackle to get that touchdown as well. As yes. to be laggy again as the extra point is up and it is good. <clears throat> Yeah, it's not just you. Mine's lagging, too. As he's going to return it to around the good return as it's a 35-yard return. 
first and ten. As Maverick Rivers is not going to go anywhere as it's going to be second down and ten. It's going to be second down and ten. King looking caught and he's not going to go anywhere. Maverick Rivers stuffed behind the backfield as it will be third down and eleven. King's going to throw a screen pass. Maverick Rivers going to get the first down. 12-yard reception. And the drive is still alive. Great screen pass uh, on third and 11. That was really risky. Yeah, really, really risky as... Ace King's going to throw, and Slim Pickens going to get that two-yard reception. It'll be second and eight. That is second down and eight. And I believe that's the... Reception right there as it's going to be third down and one. Yeah, my screen's lagging uh, really bad. Ace King is going to get negative three yards out of what I'm seeing, and it will be a punting situation. I don't think you're the only one lagging here, as mine is lagging too. And it's going to be a punt away. And it's going to be a first and ten for the FAU Owls. They're going to line up in trips. Dexter's going to scramble. He's going to run over a dude, and he's going to get a gain of five yards. Dexter just put his hand in that linebacker's chest. Is just been pushing. Pretty good. Pretty good play by Dexter right there, as it will be second down and five, as they will be lining up and trips to the top. As Dexter's looking, and that's going to be caught by Ty Bird for a first down. They're going to line up in empty formation. Man in motion. He's going to give it off to the Panda, I believe, and he's only going to gain one yard. As it's going to be second and nine, they're going to line up trips. To the top. Dexter is going to scramble. And great tackle right there. As that saved the first down. But good game by Dexter gaining eight yards. As it's going to be third and two. They're going to line up with two tight ends. As they're going to hand it off to Panda. And they're going to swarm him. Fourth down and three. Kolakovich got the tackle. Or Kolakovich, however you say it. As Army gets a big stop, and they're going to get the ball back. He's going to punt it. They're going to return it. Ooh. As he's going to get a seven-yard return as FAU only allow 15 yards throughout this first quarter so far. As it's going to be first down and 10 for Ace King and this Army offense. King's going to scramble and he's going to get a gain of six yards on that scramble. Great 
as it will be second down and four. He's going to throw it out there to Maverick Rivers, and he's going to fight for that first down. Maverick Rivers with the reception. Great play by Rivers to get that first down. I mean, he pretty much bulldozed two defenders. As he's going to throw a tight screen out there. He's going to break a tackle, and he's going to get the first down. Jay Money Jr. The reception. Money Jr. with his first catch of the dot. As Ace King stays perfect on this game, as Rivers is going to get a five-yard or six-yard gain, by the way, as it's going to be second and four. As that will be the end of the first quarter. FAU 10, Army nothing. And the second down, King. As Jay Money Jr., I'm assuming, gets that catch in the first down. As they're inside the 35 now. King. Dang, this leg is impeccable. As. <laughs> this is insane of how bad it's lagging. <laughs> I'm trying to see what's happening, but the lag is blocking out everything that's happening. As King, I believe, gets the first down as he broke off a tackle and he gets the first down. Yes, he rushed for eight yards for that first down. I did see that. As it will be first down, King's going to throw it. Slim Pickens, he's going to catch it, but nothing there. As Ace King is still perfect, a perfect 9 for 9 as it's second and 10. King's looking. He's going to try to scramble. He's going to break a sack, but he's not going to get past the line of scrimmage. Thanos Re Wells gets the sack. It will be third down and 11. Third and 11. They're going to line up in trips. King looking. First and completion of the game as Lizzie Wind is going to get the pass deflection. Army's going to have to kick a field goal. As kick is up, and it is good. It is now a 10-3 ball game. All right, Army's got on the board, and it's only a one-possession game, so uh, it's only it's still early in the game as well. Yeah, anything can happen in these last three quarters as Warren Rojo is going to get a 22-yard return. First and ten. Dexter's looking to pass. No, he's going to scramble. He's going to get around eight yards, and it will be second and two. There's just nothing but green grass, and he decided to take the scramble. As it's going to be second and two. Gonna line up with two tight ends. He's gonna hand it off to Crash Panda. Panda still on his feet. There goes Panda to the 40, the 30, the 20, the 10. Touchdown. F A U. Thrash Panda with a 66 yard touchdown run. Thrash Panda, he fought between all of that traffic and broke a tackle as well. For that 66 or 68 yard touchdown. 
Can't remember 66. which one it was. Yeah, I thought he would get stuck between all that traffic, but he somehow weaves his way out of there and gets a touchdown for FAU. As they're going to kick it off. Army's going to receive it to the 10, the 20. Travion Carter's going to get 20 yards, and it will be first and 10. Army. Let's see if they can build off that last drive they had to where they got three points. Kings. Play action. Looking. Caught by k Dog. 13 yards. I don't know if his foot was in, but... It's going to count as a first down. And in motion, he's going to go back in motion as read option. Ace King's going to break that tackle, but nowhere to go. As they swarmed him. And that will make it a third down and ten. Third and ten for Army. Army. Oh, he's going to get sacked. Batty Shark with the sack. By the way, that's the second sack of the game for Batty Shark. It will be third down and 15. Army's one for four on third downs. They're going to line up and spread. As King's going to look, he's got a man. It is Drew Stowe, and they will not get the first down as FAU will get the ball back. Seven-yard pass on third and 14 or third and 15. That was a very bad play call, to be honest with you. Yeah. I needed to go past the first down with that pass as Lindsey Wynn is going to get a nine-yard return as it's going to be first down and they will be lining up in trips to the bottom. Dexter's going to throw a screen. He's going to break a tackle and he will be tackled after a gain of four. Ronnie Shanahan Jr. As AJ Dexter is still perfect on the game. I was just going to say that. So he <laughs> <laughs> was thinking the same thing. As A.J. Dexter's going to break a sack, but Bo Cannon is going to make sure he's only going to get one yard as it's going to be third and four. Big hit by Cannon up the middle right there. Yeah, if he wouldn't have made that hit, there could have been room for Dexter to run. But now it's third and four. Dexter looking. Knocked away. Jamal Perez forces the fourth down. Great stop by Army defense there. <clears throat> That's something they needed as they're going to punt it away. And it's... Oh, Trayvon Counter was still up, but a seven-yard return for Army, and it will be first and ten at around the 27-yard line. King going to hand it off. Maverick Rivers is going to get seven yards. As For a second there, I thought he would have had the first down, but two FAU defenders came and made the tackle. As it will be second down and three. King. They're going to stuff him in the backfield. Maverick Rivers can't go anywhere. Batty Shark with another tackle for loss. Bad play call, Army. Bad play call. Third and eight now. Third and eight with trips to the bottom and... One to the top as Ace King's going to try to scramble, and he's sacked. 
Batty Sharks having one heck of a performance in the first half with her third sack of the game. Three sacks in the first half. That is going to be insane. This is going to be a good game for her. As now it's going to be fourth and 12 for this Army offense or special teams as they're going to punt it away. Going to return it, going to stiff arm somebody, and Lizzie Wynn's going to get a seven yard return. It's going to be first and ten for FAU. Dexter's looking to throw. He's going to throw, and a guy is open. Ty Bird for a gain of four yards. As they're going to line up an empty man in motion. As Dexter's going to keep it. As Dexter's losing his sense of direction. As he's going to get six <laughs> yards. And it will be third down and one. Dexter did not know where he wanted to go on that play. He wow. saw the open green grass. And he just didn't know where to go. As Thrash Panda's going to run straight down their throats, and they're going to get nine yards on that one. Thrash Panda has seven rushes for 102 yards before halftime. That is a very good performance. As Dexter gets it off right before he gets sacked, and Panda gets smushed by a Army defender as it will be a gain of six. And Dexter got the ball out quick. I mean, he was, you know, about to get sacked, and he felt it. He got the ball out to his open receiver, and, uh, you know, Thrash Panda made a play there. Yeah, as look at these yardage. FAU's tripling Army's yardage amounts, 227 to 80, as Dexter looked like he was about to scramble, but he got sacked. The lag. The lag came back for more. As it will be third down and nine. Gonna line up with trips. As it's going to be first and goal, as I believe there was a big play there. Looks like a receiver got behind a cornerback and got a big gain, as it will be first and goal from around the two-yard line. As they're going to hand it off, and Thrash Panda's going to get a two-yard touchdown run. <clears throat> Way to break the tackle in the backfield there for Thrash Panda to get that score. <clears throat> My stuff is still lagging. As they're going to take the return to around the 19-yard line, a 21-yard return for Elijah Diggs as... Batty Sharks having one heck of a performance in this first half. Three sacks by herself in one half. What do you think about that performance? Man, that is a great performance. You got six tackles, three sacks, and you got all of her tackles have been tackled for loss. As it's going to be first and ten for Ace King. He's going to scramble. Nobody's there. Ace King's going to get around midfield. 28-yard gain and a first down. Big run by King to get that 28 yards. FAU was just not ready for that. There was just nobody on that side to tackle him there. As it's going to be first and 10 from around midfield. As... Man in motion. Ace King looking. Going deep. Got a guy. It is K-Dog with a 31-yard reception. 
Hey, dog. Beat his man off the line to get open. <laughs> and Dexter, or King, saw that. Great play by Army there. As just two plays ago, they were inside their own 20. Now they're almost inside the red zone. As King's going to look, he's got a man, and it's going to be incomplete. Great play there. The receiver just couldn't get his foot down in bounds. As it's going to be second and ten, they're going to call on the screen as Maverick River is going to get a gain of five. Brings up a manageable third and five. As they're going to line up in trips. King looking. Got a man. It is Drew Stowe with the first down. King's going to feed it off to Maverick Rivers, and he finds his way through that traffic and gets Army's first touchdown of the game. What a great drive by Army on that on that drive right there. I mean, you know, they come out and they got some more points on the board. So their defense just needs to step up. I mean, they've been doing okay, but, they're, you know, you can't win a game if your defense can't stop. You know, you can't stop anybody. Yeah, defense is a key component of a win as he's not going to go anywhere. 15 yards on that return. Warren Rojo. Great play by the special teams of Army. As FAU is going to line up on the 13 with first and 10. They're going to hand it off to Panda, and he's going to get a gain of five. Let's see if they go conservative or aggressive here. As it's going to be second down and five. They're going to line up in trips. Ways the clock down inside the 30 seconds. And they're going to snap the ball, and they're going to pass it. Dexter's going to scramble, and he's going to barely get that first down. <clears throat> as that will be the last play of the first half. As what are your thoughts of this first half? Oh, the, uh, I mean, FAUs, they come out and they're running the ball pretty well. Army's defense can't stop the run. I mean, they have, uh, I think, over uh, almost 200 yards in rushing. I think it's around 180, 180 or 185. Um, so Army's defense needs to come out in the second half and stop the run. Um, as far as Army's offense goes, they just need to try to move the ball down the field. Um, they've had several, a couple of big plays. Um, with the receiver open, so maybe try to get your receivers open more and see if, you know, you can get some more points on the board. And the total yardage, 85 passing yards. Army's kind of got them in passing yards. FAU's dominating the rushing yards around the same time of possession and a clean game as no turnovers for either team. Hopefully it won't come back to bite me like UL and Texas Tech when I said that. <laughs> uh, they're going to kick it off. He's going to get the ball in the second half. They're going to return it to the 20 around the 25-yard line. Travion Carter. <clears throat> they get a return as it's going to be first and ten for this army offense. Man in motion. He's gonna audible and 
Ace King's gonna scramble and he's gonna fall forward for a gain of six yards. As it will be second and four. Second and four trips to the top as great tackle there by number 19, Levy times the third, as it's going to be third and four. Armin needs to seven. get a first down here. Two for seven on third downs here as Ace King's looking and he's got a man. It's Jay Money Jr. He's going to get a 15-yard reception and it will be a first down. Great play by Money Jr. to get open. Uh, great route. And that was a great block there so he wouldn't get tackled to get some extra yards. As it will be first and 10 from around the 47 yard line. King's going to drop back. He's going to throw. He's got K Dog for another first down. And it will be first and 10. Army. As it will be first and ten, I believe it's in the pistol as he's going to hand it off. Maverick River is going to get the first down as a 15-yard rush there. First down. Great blocking by the line to open up that hole for Rivers to get that big game. That was just a big hole for him. Anybody could have seen that as it's going to be a first and ten. King's going to throw it, going to throw a man off of him as number 39 is going to get the first down. By the way, that's Randy Savage. Going to get actually nine yards, not the first down. As it's going to be second and one. King's going to hand it off to Rivers, and Rivers going to get the one yard that they needed and got to get a first down. First and ten from the red zone. <clears throat> As Ace King's going to throw, and I don't know what happened there. Looked like it's incomplete, and it will be second and ten. They're going to line up in a close bunch. As King's going to look. Dangerous pass as K Dog's gonna catch that for three yards and it will be third and eight, third and seven. Uh, third and seven on the thirteen yard line or so. Uh, they need to get a first down here to keep this drive alive. As King's gonna try to scramble and Batty Shark's gonna prevent him from getting that first down. Yet another sack for number twenty. As Army's going to have to kick a field goal. Kick is up and it is good. Army's only down 11 now, but if I was Army's offense, I would have wanted to score a touchdown there. As FAU's going to get the ball. Going to return it to around the 25-yard line. Warren Rojo is going to get a 27-yard return. Yeah, Army on that last drive, they should have scored a touchdown there. And you wanted to score a touchdown there. But, I mean, there's still time left in the game. Yeah, it's going to be first and 10 as that pass is caught to Ronnie Shanahan Jr. as a gain of one yard and will be second down and nine. If Shanahan Jr. wouldn't have been there, he would have. That would have been an incomplete pass. This is going to be second and nine from around the twenty-seven yard line. Dexter gonna call onto the screen. He's gonna get Thrash Panda, and it's going to be a gain of seven yards, and it will be third and two. Third and two, going to line up with two backs, man in motion. Dexter's going to look almost intercepted as it's going to be caught by Ty Bird for a first down. What a close play. That was really close. 
Yeah, for a second there, I thought I was about to call an army pick six as Dexter's going to throw and, and he's got a man. It's Ty Bird for the first down. And it's going to be first down from around the 40. Dexter's going to drop back. Dexter's going to throw. He's got Thrash Panda, and Thrash Panda's going to get six yards, and it'll be second and four. As he's going to hand it off, Thrash Panda's going to break a tackle, going to get inside the 20, as that's going to be a good run for the FAU offense. Great run by Thrash Panda. I believe he's well over 120 yards now. As they're going to line up with two backs in the backfield. Man in motion. He's going to go out to block as Dexter for a second there. He has some room, but Army's going to close in. As it's going to be second and eight. As it's going to be a sack for Army, as it's going to be third and nine. Be right back. Need to go do something right quick. I believe that is. Um, Army's like second sack or third sack, I believe. It's going to be As down. And Warren Rojo is going to get a 12-yard reception, and it will be a first down. First and goal, and off, Thrash Panda, one yard, and it's going to be second and goal. Second and goal with two tight ends. He's going to hand it off to Panda, and that's going to be a touchdown. Pick is up, and it's good. They're going to kick it off. To 20 round. As Ace King has been sacked quite a bit. As you see, the Owls have five total sacks. Three or four of them coming from Batty Sharp, I think it is, or Clark? Yes. As it's going to be first down, Maverick River is going to get eight yards. It's going to be a second and two. Second and two. He's going to hand it off. The defender, I don't know what he was doing, as it's going to be five yards for Maverick River, and it's going to be a first down. First and ten, he's going to hand it off. River's going to get five yards. And be second down at five. They're going to line up an empty here. King going to scramble, going to break a sack as he's going to get lit up. As I believe that's number five who made the play there. To make the hit. <clears throat> and this is going to be third down and two. King. Makes a play action pass. And he's got a man. It's Drew Stowe. And it's going to be a first down. Good job by Stowe to get that first down. As Army's going to line it 
up and trip. He's going to hand it off to Maverick Rivers, and that's going to be a gain of seven yards. And man in motion, going to hand off. Maverick Rivers not going anywhere. Yeah, FAU got in the backfield pretty quick. And Army Sports to 10 on third down, looking to make it 5 for 11. As he's going to scramble, going to finally get around that edge, and he's going to fling himself through the first down. He would have had a whole lot more yardage, but his, his blocker right there, was he ran into him. Uh, this is going to be first and ten. They're going to line up in bunch. King's going to look, and that one's going to be incomplete. Second and ten. Man in motion. Going to hand it off. Maverick River's going to get... One yard, and it's going to be third and nine. And Lee Wynn makes that tackle right there. Third and nine, and they're in the red zone. They need to get past the 10-yard line. They really need this first down. as They're going to call a screen, and he ran into his blockers, and it will be a fourth down and nine. The dreaded third and screen. Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. And kick is up and it's good. FAU. You can return it to the 10, the 20, the 30. Going to be brung down and around the 33-yard line. Warren Rocho is going to get a great return. As it's first and 10 for FAU with drips to the bottom. Dexter's going to drop back. Going to throw. Got slashed hand up. For man, but he won't. And he will only get two yards from that. And Army brought a lot of pressure, too, as well. On that play. <laughs> that caused them to get it out early. So, uh, it's going to be second down the flat. There he goes. Oh, he gets two straight tackles. But still a great catch and one by Ronnie Danahan Jr. Danahan Jr. Great route. Great catch. He broke the broke tackle. <laughs> Five yard rush there for Panda. It's the end of the third quarter. Get your fours up in the chat. Your score is 31 FAU and Army 16. As we start the fourth quarter here. Yeah, I'll be back in around like maybe five minutes. As my buckle is about to die, as that pass is incomplete. They're going to come out with shotgun formation. He's going to throw a screen pass. He's going to break off of a tackle, break off two tackles. Thrash Panda gets no yardage, brings up fourth and five. They're going to go for a long field goal here. It looks like about a 54, 55, almost 55 yard field goal. It is no good. It looks like he pushed it left. He did. He had the distance. He just pushed it left.
second and ten. Army's going to come out, trips to the bottom, uh, back in the backfield. He's going to quick screen out to the left, almost tipped, but k Dog gets it, three-yard reception, brings up third and seven. Third and seven. Army's going to come out shotgun, three to the bottom, one to the top. Pick off a diving interception by FAU. That is the first turnover of the game here in the fourth quarter. Levi, team, time team, Tim's, how do you say it? I don't know, but great job, FAU defense. Dexter's going to run it, and he's going to get 10 yards, but brings up second and inches. Shotgun formation, two to the top, one to the bottom. He's going to fake the handoff. He's going to throw it, and it's tipped by Trayvon Carter. Brings up third and inches. Trips to the top, one at the bottom, or back in the backfield. They're going to hand the ball off. He's going to get a 14-yard gain. Thrash Panda with 149 yards on the night. And they are in the red zone. Two-yard reception by Rojo or Rojo. He's got 71 yards on four catches on the night. Dexter's 20 for 23, the 164 yards, and Bo Cannon had just got his 12th tackle. Man in motion, back to the backfield, hands the ball off. Eight-yard rush by Thrash Panda brings up first and goal. Trips to the bottom, one to the top, back in the backfield. He's going to try to run, but sack for a four-yard loss. Brings up second and goal. As D's get the sack, it's the second sack of the night. Two to the top, one in the backfield. Going to fake the handoff. Dexter gets dropped in the backfield for a four-yard loss. Bo Cannon with his 13th tackle. Man in motion. Nowhere to go. Sacked for a nine-yard loss. Brings up fourth and goal. D's with his third sack of the game. He would kick about a 32-yard field goal. Or 42-yard field goal. The kick is up, and it is good. FAU 34, Army 16, with six minutes and one second left in the game. Army is going to return it out. They're going to start on about the 17-yard line. Third and three coming for the Army. 
trips to the bottom, one of the top. Gonna hand the ball off to Rivers. Rivers gets eight yards for a first down. Five thirty remaining in the game. Screen pass. And he breaks off one tackle, but not the second one and gets dropped for a two yard loss. Lee wins with 10 tackles tonight. <clears throat> Bring second and 12 for Army. They're going to come out with an empty set. Man in motion. He's going to fake the quick screen. No, he's going to throw it to him now. He gets a one yard reception. Brings a third and 11. To the top, two to the bottom, back in the backfield. Looks like it's going to be a screenplay again. And my stuff froze. Fourth and nine, and they're going to go for it. They don't get the first down, it looks like. Dex is going to run, brings up, uh, picks up four yards, brings up second and six. Dex is going to pass to P. Jacob Ware for eight yard reception, brings up first and ten. Wide open receiver. That's Rojo. 20 yard reception. Brings up first and goal for FAU. It's going to be a first and goal for the FAU Owl. First and goal. AJ Dexter going to scramble, going to fly. He could have maybe had a touchdown there if he decided not to fly, but it's going to be second and goal. Uh, it's going to be second and goal. They're going to wind down the clock. They're going to hike it. They're going to throw it. There was nobody there. It's going to be incomplete. Third and goal. It's going to be third and goal for FAU. And it's going to be, I believe, an incomplete pass, maybe. And it's yes. going to be fourth down and goal. And FAU is going to extend their lead to 21. They're going to kick it off. Army's going to return to the 10, the 20, to around the 22 yard line. Elijah Diggs. Gonna get 22 yards on that return, and it will be first and 10 for Army. King dropping back, gonna throw. It's gonna be Glenn Pickett for eight yards, and it'll be second and two. Great pickup by Pickens. Uh, 
As King's going to throw. He's got Elijah Diggs for a first down. They're going to hurry up. Going to line up with two backs in the backfield. King's going to drop back to throw. He's going to throw it. Got number 39. There's nowhere to go. One yard. Randy Savage. And it will be second and nine. Around two minutes left in the ball game. King. Going to throw. Got number one, which is Elijah Diggs. And they're going to hurry up back to the line. They're going to line up with the pistol. Go ahead. I was saying great catch by Elijah Diggs to get that first down for him. Uh, King gets humbled by Rokon Dotson for the sack as it's going to be second down at 15. Ace King going to throw it down the middle. He's got Drew Stowe, and it's going to be a 26-yard game. First and 10. Ace King going to throw it. Got k on for the touchdown. Great drive by the Army offense there to get that touchdown on that drive. Now they're probably going to go for two here. They may kick it. But we'll see. Nope, they're going to kick it. Uh, they're going to make it a 14-point game. No matter what, they're going to need an onside kick here. Uh, they're going to kick it, and Thrash Panda is going to get the ball, and it will be first and 10 FAU. As Thrash Panda has been a big reason why they're up by 14 right now. Yeah, I don't see how Thrash Panda won't get um, player of the game. I mean, as you see his stats there, three touchdowns over 157 yards on 15 carries. Yeah, pretty great performance as it's going to be first down. Thrash Panda is going to get two yards as Army's going to call their first timeout. Going to be second and eight as FAU's nearing field goal range. As they're going to hand it off to Panda again, and that will ice the game. First and ten for FAU. Going to hand it off to Panda again as Panda's going to get a gain of four, and it's going to be second down and six. Going to hand it off to Panda again. Going to get another first down. As this next play will probably be the last play of the game. And Dexter's going to kneel it down. And that will do it for this football game. That was a great game all the way around. FAU come out and they just, you know, Army couldn't, you know, Army couldn't stop the run, and that was what really got FAU up pretty big, is because of Thrash Panda. Uh, you see, there 181 yards and three touchdowns just by rushing. So I mean, Army's defense couldn't stop the run, and that was a big reason why FAU went up so big. I mean. They Army came back, but FAU was up by 21, I believe it was, before they came back. So, yeah. And this is Luca Garcia and Anthony Grant saying good night, ECFL. And they prepared for the second game. 